losing the draw back to the point. It's chipped in by the Cape Breton defenseman into the corner. Sveshnikov knocked off the puck there by Garrett Johnson. Johnson picking it up number three. Long lead pass up the middle. There's a breakaway coming in. Askew with the score! Cameron Askew with a beautiful play. Connor Garland on the goal. A beautiful pass there from Garrett Johnson and the league scoring champion and MVP knocking him out here with a nice breakaway goal. M game. Don't forget three o'clock for all your Sunday games. We'll be on the air at 2.40 with the pregame show. Off the faceoff, Malatesta throwing it long into the Cape Breton zone. In the power play for the Eagles, 20 seconds. They hit the Moncton blue line, throwing it across the line. Bowden, the defenseman, fanned on it. Back in behind the net to Clark Bishop. Bishop on the wing, it's back to Loic Livy. In the shot, they score! The Eagles on a blast, I'm sure. Fortin was screened on that. Loic Livy. A power play goal with his third in two games. Right to the corner, he'll slip it back to the point. Adam Hallwell a drive. Quickly blocked in front by the Cape Breton defenseman. Connor Garland with the puck now along the boards. Garland cuts across the blue line, having a look around. Garland takes a couple of good whacks there from Sveshnikov. Garland centers it a shot. McEwen got a piece of it, not quite enough, and it was deflected. Garland picks it up again in front of the net. Garland still with it. There's a play in front. A shot by McEwen, another drive. Nice save. There's Johnson, a shot, and Jessamine got his arm on it. Power play for the Wallach. Cape Breton blue line, Askew charging hard after it with Gusslin. Gusslin throws it around the wall. It ends up back on the point to Clark Bishop. Bishop throws it across the Cape Breton blue line to Gusslin. He'll hit center ice, tried to make a long lead pass there. Sorrentino coming in the shot, and Fortin with a glove save on the big Sorrentino. Busting in off the wing. Sorrentino has the only goal tonight. Anthony Sorrentino also scored in Cape Breton on Wednesday evening. Eagles, Yannick Bertrand, six foot two, getting the extra two minutes. We'll wait for the announcement from John Richard. Wildcats are on the power play in the Cape Breton zone. Zach McEwen has the puck in the corner. McEwen still with it. Slides it across. There's a pass in front. Holwell scores! Adam Holwell comes in from the blue line and rips it on a pass from Cam Askew. The Wildcats take a 2-1 lead, 20 years wild. That's a power play goal and a beauty. Second goal. Manuel Weeder has the puck behind the net. Weeder now will swing out. Number 21 with great speed, flies down the wing. Weeder hits the blue line, throws it in behind Jessamine. Centering pass in front. Max Glassell lets it go. Just big save there by the goaltender Jessamine. Centered again, Garland scores! Connor Garland! On a bang-bang play as they were announcing the second goal. Garland wraps it in, and it's 3-1. That goal coming up. Johnson, wide of Jessamine in the Cape Breton net. Holwell and Garland have made it 3-1. Holwell drill from behind by the big Russian Sveshnikov, and they all pile in there. That would be what I would say uh, predictable hit. He certainly knew he was going to hit him. Will Smith in there. With Vic Sveshnikov, there'll be penalties there. No uncertain terms. Holwell with his back to the play. In came the big Russian and slammed him into the Wildcat bench. Those penalties now at 425. Holwell's okay. 50 remaining in that long five minute power play. The Cats with the puck now at center ice. Garrett Johnson will simply throw it in behind the net to Kevin Klima. Klima along the board still with it. Back to his brother Kelly. Kevin Klima slips it back to the point nicely. Zach Malatesta along the boards. Garland Cape is still out there. Eagles Garland looking for a setup. Throws it in front. In front of the net. Kelly Klima missed the open net from his brother Kevin. I can't tell you how open that net was. There's a slap shot in heavy traffic. Rebound. Two saves by Forte. Back to the point. LeBlanc with a shot. Deflected wide. Wildcats are up 3-1. 7.55. Good pressure by Cape Breton in the Moncton zone. Malatesta. Flipping it off the boards, but kept in there by the big Dubois. It's in front dangerously. A backhand shot off the post. It's in the net. Number 11, Clark Bishop with the goal. Dubois keeping it in at the blue line. And the Cape Breton Screaming Eagles are on the board. 7.43. Clark Bishop, assisted by number 18, of the du numéro 18, Pierre-Luc Dubois. At 12.17, at 12 minutes, 17 seconds. Clark Bishop. At 12.17 from Pierre-Luc Dubois. 
It is 3-2 Wildcats with seven minutes to go. There's a play in front off the crossbar. The light's on. They score. Cam Askew on a bang-bang play off the faceoff. Just as we came back to live action. And just like that, the Wildcats take the lead 4-2. That goal. In the second period, long slap shot by Cape Britton, easily gloved by Forta. He'll give it to his defenseman, Holwell, behind the net. Over to his partner, Garrett Johnson. Up the boards they go. Cape Britton throws it right back in. Johnson now with the puck inside the line. Garland picks it out of nowhere. It's a one-on-one. -on -one. Garland cutting in. They score! Garland, what a move on that Cape Breton defenseman. Connor Garland for the hat trick. Here come the hats. What a shift on that Cape Breton defenseman in front of the net. And with 29 seconds, throw it in. The Eagles trying to get going at their own blue line. Colby Tower, number 17. There's a fight. And it's Matt Klebanski. No, Lane Cormier throwing a lot on number 24. That's the rematch, I think, with Yannick Bertrand. If I can get that sweater. Cormier has the sweater over the Cape Breton player's head and throwing in a couple of good rights. I just can't see that number well enough. And it's definitely Lane Cormier for Munkin. They're throwing a pretty good. Cormier has him in a headlock. And a lot of the shots by the Cape Breton player off the helmet. Cormier lands on top. Decision, Lane Cormier. This all coming, yes, it was Mr. Bertrand, so a rematch from earlier. Change there by the big number 11. Referees, the arms aren't going up. There's players all over the ice. They're scrumming in the corner. Zach McEwen is going at it with number 20, Duncan McIntyre. The referees, Brad Mills and Todd Tominder. McEwen in there, throwing the Eagle player to the boards, a right over linesman and two other players piling in behind the net. It's a throw back to Wednesday night. McEwen now with the helmet off. And the mouth guard off, going to the bench.